For patients with cancer cachexia, there is an increased risk of death, and pharmacologic treatment options are limited. The level of growth differentiation factor 15, or GDF15, a circulating cytokine, is elevated in cancer cachexia. Ponsegramab, a humanized monoclonal antibody inhibiting GDF15, was associated with improved outcomes among patients with cancer cachexia and elevated GDF15 levels in a small Phase 1b study. In this Phase 2 double-blind placebo-controlled trial, 187 adults with cancer cachexia and elevated serum GDF-15 levels were assigned to receive ponsegramab at a dose of 100 mg, 200 mg, or 400 mg, or to receive placebo, administered subcutaneously every four weeks for three doses. The primary endpoint, the change from baseline in body weight at 12 weeks, was significantly greater with ponsegramab than with placebo with a median between-group difference of 1.2 kg in the 100 mg group, 1.9 kg in the 200 mg group, and 2.8 kg in the 400 mg group. Among the key secondary endpoints, the functional assessment of anorexia cachexia treatment, anorexia cachexia subscale, which ranges from 0 to 48, with higher scores indicating a better outcome, and a four-point increase identified as a response, favored the 400 mg ponsegramab group over placebo. The score on the functional assessment of anorexia cachexia treatment 5-item anorexia symptom scale, which ranges from 0 to 20, with higher scores indicating a better outcome and a 2-point increase identified as a response, also favored the 400 mg ponsegramab group over placebo. Where measured, muscle mass also increased. The percentage of patients reporting an adverse event of any cause was similar across all groups. The authors conclude that among patients with cancer cachexia and an elevated GDF-15 level, the inhibition of GDF-15 with ponsegramab significantly increased body weight at 12 weeks as compared with placebo. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.